Hi right, hey everybody, this is Levi here from the Buzz Cowboy, and today I'm bringing you another commentary. Today we are going to be playing some more Boons Tower Defense 5. We're going to be playing Park Path, which is the second track featured in this game. We're going to be playing it on hard, going for the gold medal. Um, as you can see here, um, I'm using the monkey buckling off the bat, it's not that hard. What you're going to want to do is get that and uh, try and place it off to the side so you can put more of them. You're going to want to put as many as you can there. I think you can fit three. Um, you're going to want to upgrade the first two upgrades on the path one, the left hand side, and then the first upgrade on the right hand side, and then just get another one. And when you have those, you can ride it for quite a while. Um, so while this is going to rock on, I'm going to tell you a couple things. First of all, is that, sorry I haven't been able to post this for a while, school and life is crazy, guys. I don't know, you guys obviously don't know a lot of stuff about my life. But I'm assuming you can guess some of this stuff. So, what the deal is, is a lot of times, it's just life is unpredictable. Homework one night to the next is so different. I might have, you know, 30 minutes of one homework one night, and then the next night have four hours. You know, you never know. So, I, I try the best I can to do the best I can with it, but sometimes you just can't. It's crazy. So, yep. So, like I said, you're going to want to fit as many of those monkey buccaneers as you can. And then, as soon as you get three of those, like I said, with two upgrades on the left side, one upgrade on the right side, you are going to want to start saving up for a super monkey because you're really going to need a super monkey in this. Uh, the super monkey is what's going to save you, specifically the robo monkey once you upgrade from the plasma. You get the plasma vision and then go down the other side and get the robo monkey. That's pretty much how you're going to win this. It's essential to doing that. How it's actually ended up going to work out is you're going to get the robo monkey and then that'll last you long enough for you to just get multiple sun gods. And that's how you're going to win. Uh, I also happen to get no lives lost in this, which is not probably going to be a trend I do, but um, I haven't lost any lives yet so far in the series, so you know, I'll probably just try and continue with it. And if it gets too hard, I won't sweat it. It's not that big of a deal for me. Um, the tax shooter will help with that though, so I just put it down there just in case, so, you know, if I do decide to go for it, then yeah, it's really helpful for that. But yeah, like I said, you're just going to want to keep getting these super monkeys, and other than that, it's not a big deal. The banana thumb down there is optional. I like it, it helps out. Um, one thing I don't like though is it makes the earlier rounds really hard having to sacrifice that 1000 money really soon. It's not something I like to do, but, you know, it helps a lot with getting all those super monkeys. You don't have to upgrade it all the way on the left side to get the whole crud load of money. Just upgrading it three times will do. And so that's what you see I did here. And at this point, I'm almost just dragging out my commentary. It's only been three minutes, but once you get to this point, it's pretty much just a guaranteed win. You just ride it all along. So anyway, guys, yeah, that's pretty much how you're going to want to do this. Now for some just uh, in general updates. What I'm going to try and do is overall, I'm going to try and keep it so that Scarlet Sword is as many days as I can in the week. I try and make it as many days as I can. Usually that only ends up being three or four days a week. I am sorry. Like I said, school and stuff is crazy. You never know what you're going to get. And on the weekends, I'll try and post some Boots Hard Fence 5. See, this game, it wasn't that hard to get. I got on my first try, but like the last one, I had a ton of editing I had to do because I needed to figure out how to capture my screen. There's a bunch of other problems, just first time stuff that you gotta go through when you're an LP and you're finding out new stuff. It just it's gonna happen. So but now that I have that stuff for the most part cleaned up and taken care of, it went a lot faster. This video taking me a lot less time to make. Got it on my first try, I was pretty happy. So yeah, um as long as you follow the strategy you guys you should be fine. Um it's pretty simple but yeah it's not that hard, like I said, um, you get 150 monkey money, I believe, once you beat it, and it's absolutely essential you put that dart monkey there, or you are going to die. So yeah, anyway guys, thanks for watching, see you later, and bye.